You can see some loops on there. Um, I've just used a punch and punched that out. And I've used some stripy paper um, as well at the back, which I distressed. And some of this um, ribbon. Uh, it's like a velvet ribbon running through this trim. Um, I've also put um, that on. Excuse me. I've just got to plug myself in before I go flat on the battery while I'm still talking to you. So, sorry about that. That's it, plugged in. And on the back of um, the folder again you can see this paper line coming round and as you can see there it's fluted um, I've this I've bought this round I haven't put any pocket into the back and then obviously this is another piece of the um, bow no prima printery paper and again some black card and some trim. Um, now the bits that I've done inside I've used um, I've done 12 lots so you can use it however you want to use it monthly or whatever. Um, so I've just used some plain card which I've die cut out um, as you can see there um, so you can log on to this you can put like just put a a plain cut out piece of paper and, and log on that if you want to or just put um whatever you're going to keep in this um i've just put um, a piece of strip of paper that i've used um that when i did the pages and i cut the pages down these were just some bits left so you can write on those I've got these little plastic wallets um, which I've put um, die cuts in so I've done this like a, like a die cut holder if you like and there's some um, like Prima um, tags and stuff like that in there and all my die cuts when I, um, oop, when I cut them out I can store them in there as well so it just keeps them nice and clean and they won't fall out. And um, these are, we are Memory Keeper uh, wallets 5x7. I then put a piece of um, patterned acetate in. Um, you can use this on your projects or whatever you want to use it for. And then I've used this um, paper line. And these were the Prima pads. I think these were the Prima pads. Um, the life of me, I can't think. The Ledger pads. Um, this one's just got like sweet memories in the corner. And you can, you can write all whatever you're keeping in your wallets or projects you want to do or whatever, you know, what, keep whatever you want in there. So I'll just go through them quickly because they're all different pages. These bits of cards that I've put in, they've all been punched differently. The little pieces of paper, card rather, in here, they're all different. My die cuts these are like my paris and my big ben a linen tower pizza 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 um i've just put those in this one in this one i've got the the glitter acetate in i just thought it would just look nice when i put it in so and again this all these papers are from the ledger pads um that i had um, this one, I've just cut the corners off on this one, and again, um, more die cuts in there. These are all my hearts. Um, I've used this, um, I can't never remember what this 
paper's called, but this one's embossed and these are the ones that you can um, use one of those ball pens and you know what I mean. Again some different um, ledger paper. This one I've cut out on the hearts and again this one's numbered so you can write on that. I've put tags um, in this particular wallet and what I've used in here is some material um, it's like a silver rose and it's very very fine um, material again like I said all ledgers um, that's got the loop in that I've cut out bits of card got my shields and that in that one and some more of this um, patterned acetate and basically that's how um, I've gone through my folder and just popping these um, in and I just I like the idea um, when I was doing it and um, yeah, I'd like it, you know, if you could leave a comment um, as to what you think really of, of my project. I've got some tags in this one, um, like little, the ticket tags these ones are, and they're all um, like the Prima and the Vintage Lace. Um, uh, collection um, like that uh, it's just like you know where I could store my little bits and bobs and I'm thinking obviously I'm gonna put like little tags like, tags on the end of here um, so that you can just you know go to the tag and go straight in um, to your die cuts um, so you know where to find them I've um, got some different tag ones in there. Um, this is a different, um, this is a, a much thicker material. Um, it's got like this um, gold glitter weave through it. Um, but like I said, um, all the papers are from the Prima Ledger packs. Um, I've just used different coloured card. Um, all through 6x6 six six card and I've just stamped them or punched them differently not stamped them sorry just punched them differently and obviously the off cuts from the paper I've just put in um, as well and then this one I've got laser cuts and I've got birds in that one uh, vellum that's the material I was thinking of this one's a pattern vellum um, again, it's just, I've just rounded the corners of this one off. Um, haven't got anything in the wallet of that one at the moment. So I've got some more of this glitter acetate in. Um, and basically, that's my binder. And that's what I came up with. Um, I really uh, this was um, inspired by um, one of Swelly Do's kits and that so you know please check her out um, and uh, but if you can please could you leave a comment and um, it would just be um, to let me know really what you think of um, what I've done, what inspired me from watching the Swirly Do um, video on YouTube, and this this is just an idea that I came up with. Um, so I really do hope you like it, and like I said, please um, leave a comment because you know your comments are really important to me. Um, and that's it really crafters and thanks again for watching 
had fun making it and I hope you have fun watching. Thanks